Well, hello everyone, and welcome back here to Plants vs Zombies. We're on the mini game screen, and as you can see, we've only got a few left. We'll have to start thinking about what I'm going to do after this fairly soon. All right, we're going to play Zombosony 2. This time, the zombies shoot back. Right, so we have we have shooter zombies, we have Gatling gun zombies, we have various sorts of blocker zombies, we have squash zombies, which just feels like a betray. That's a stab in the heart. That is squash turning against me, and we have chili pepper zombies, and I feel the best thing to do here is to try to count, cut down on the number of lanes that the zombies can attack us on that way we can build up some defenses quite easily so in order to do that we shall go to the garlic <laughs> it shall be its stinky yet not so very ugly head and um, on top of that we need some light we are going to need weapons but I think for a change I'm going to use the cabbage pot and the kernel pot because they, they work out a little bit cheaper to build up an array of them. So for our defenses, we'll take that. And we're going to need the lily pad because there's a pool, which leaves us with two more squares. And I am thinking in those two squares, we shall take the tangle pod and we shall have, we shall fight squash with squash. Let's rock. So, ideally what I want to do here is I want to start building up some some sunlight, but unlike usual when I do this at the back, I want to actually do this up two rows here with the garlic at the front. So, let's get another one out here. There we go. A little bit of a problem here with this first zombie. Might take out that flower. But I don't think he will. There we go. Smack. Brilliant. Okay, so now we can get... Alright, so let's get garlic down there. And that gives us a hundred, so we'll put him there. And now every zombie is going to come down this side. And let's get another flower in. There we go. Next thing we want to get here is... Oh good, they can't kind of come down here. Let's put ourselves a walnut there. And that's this size defense is pretty much sorted out. We just need to build up our offensive capabilities, which we shall do. But, right, so let's get you there. And actually, I'll tell you what, let's squash you guys for now. That gives us a moment to build up our defenses a little bit more. There we go. That's good. It gives us a bit more sunlight. We'll put that there. And a, ca a cabbage pulp there. Okay, so there we go. That's our basic land defense is done. Now we need to start working on something in the water. And I think we want to reinforce this garlic a little bit as well. Just in case this one gets destroyed. Let's have a backup garlic. So we'll bung him there. Like that. Let's put you in there. That will stop down the slow down the number of times we get shot at. There we go, and now the water has started. So I'll cheat with you and block you off. Now we just want to get some sunlight pretty quickly. So take you there. A little bit more sunlight. There we go. Right, that's that row sorted out. I think we're probably going to have to squash this guy, but it's not the end of the world. Right, this garlic is getting a bit nibbled, so we need to bear that in mind. Okay, so we'll chuck you there, chuck you there. Splash, sorted. Excellent. We're coming up to our first big wave of zombie series as well. So we'll put you there, grab that coin. 
You know what, just one more piece of sunlight, please. There we go. And that is our basic defences sorted out. There we go. And we'll stick a second piece of garlic there, just to be on the safe side. Right, let's see what we've got here. Don't like the look of this guy. So I think we'll squash him. And he squashed the wrong one. Well done, squash. But never mind, still made life a little bit easier. There we go. We lost our garlic there. Let's put him there. And I feel we're probably going to need to upgrade that fairly soon. But let's actually put that there first. There we go. Reinforce that. And now I think we can get another cabbage pot there and set up the offensive capabilities. Oh, bugger. Okay, that's not good. That is not good. Okay, that's a slight problem, but I think we can still get around that. We're just going to need to use uh, one of the lawnmowers. We'll start putting things in behind him, I think. There we go, so we get our defences back going. Oh, good, we didn't use the lawnmower in the end. That's a <laughs> small mercy, I suppose. All right. So let's start getting some offensive capability back here. Running a little bit long garlic here. Something we need to deal with. But first, I think we'll put a cabbage pot there. Let's squash this guy. There we go, that'll make life a little bit easier. And let's get another sunflower out. Speed up our sun acquisition. If I had a bit more space, I'd get the double-headed sunflowers in here. They would have been ideal for this. There, that's back in place. And we can pop you there. Right. Now we're starting to get together. Right, squash will deal with you. Let's get this garlic back in place. Like that. And we're going to need another squash for this guy here. Fortunately. We have another squash for that guy there. Okay. And we need a garlic for the corner there. There we go. Right. Oh dear, I didn't see that guy. That's a bit of a problem. Well, I think we just got around it. There we go. Right. I think actually I should have moved these... Uh, Walnuts one step out. It would have made life a lot easier. I think it would make life a lot easier. There we go. Let's deal with him. There we go. Okay. What a tangled web of kelp we weave. Yeah, we don't need to deal with that guy, I think. And they're going to need a new walnut there. And please give me a squash. Oh, that's bad. Okay, that's a problem. All right. Let's try to deal with this. Just before a large wave appears, of course. Uh, at least we only had the one guy. That could have gone a lot worse. Let's just squash him, and then we've got time to rebuild. Okay, so we'll put you there. One step forward, we've got a cabbage pot there, so you're doing the business. Um, kelp you, because we just don't need to take that amount of damage. And I think we are actually making fairly good progress on this now. Let's get another garlic in there. Let's get you there. Uh, we could use another kelp quickly here, I think, but... Right, so we'll just bolster that up for now. Okay. 
There you go, that was reducing the amount of damage we're taking there. Let's pop you in here. There we go, they damage you quite a lot. is not looking good. Let's put a squash there. Excellent. Okay. Slow you down a little bit. Oh, which one do I squash? At that. We're going to lose this row, aren't we? Yes, we are. Another one that's broken through back here. Okay, I think we're going to have to rely on a lawnmower here. In fact, I'm just going to work on that assumption. Let's squash you. There we go. Get another garlic there. Okay. At least it's got rid of you. Let's put you up there. What are you? One of you. And of course, has to be another one. No, two of these. That's great. <laughs> okay, come on. Got you, got you. Oh, goal. Got you both. Excellent. Okay. Right, we'll help you, I think. Yep. And let's get another one of you in there. And put that there. Okay, so our defences are holding up not particularly well, not as well as I would like, but they are holding up. So not doing too badly. Okay, so need another walnut there. Uh, just as soon as we can. We'll pop a piece of kelp there to bolster our defences there a little bit. And this is the final wave. We survive this and we're done. Okay, so let's get let's get you there. Oh good work. Let's get you there. There we go. <laughs> Mutually assured squashing, and why not? Okay. So now all we really need to do is just survive this wave. And I think we are doing pretty well in that. So our problems are here, but we're just about to get another squash. And I think that will make all of our problems go away. There we go. Just bolster that up, just in case. And now it's just a matter of time. There we go, almost got him, and we've got him. So, that's unlocked a new minigame. Dr. Zomboss's Revenge. So next time it'll be Walnut Bowling, but before we go, let's just pop to the shops because I noticed we've got $25,000. Shop, there it is. Okay, so what can we buy? Oh, we can get nine slots. Now that is really tempting. We can get this, which turns the uh, the, the spikes into the spike weeds into spike rocks, which really upgrades them. The winter melons is really nice. Hmm. Stuff for the garden. We haven't really done the gardens. So let's not worry about that. More stuff for the garden. We haven't done the gardens. So let's not worry about that. Let's get nine slots. So now we can take nine seeds with us onto a level. 
and the unlikely event we get up to 80,000, it can go up to 10. Well, there you go. I think that's it for now. I hope you will join me in the next time, which hopefully will be far, far sooner than it's been between this episode and the last episode. Sorry about that. So until then, I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Plants vs. Zombies. Thank you. And good night.